Hey everybody, 8-Bit Josh here and welcome to my little Planet Coaster Ghostbusters DLC sort of speculation kind of video. So it was just announced today, uh, May 22nd, the most recent downloadable content DLC for Planet Coaster is the Ghostbusters. And normally I don't do these sort of kind of speculation um, videos, but because Ghostbusters, the original Ghostbusters, is like one of my all-time, absolute all-time favorite movies, and I was just super excited to hear about this DLC, I was like, you know what, it'd be super fun to kind of do like a little speculation, like maybe what what's going to be included. I just thought it'd be fun to do this. So on the screen, you can see, yes, yes, the, it does come with uh, the four original Ghostbusters. You have Winston, you have Ray, you have Egon, and of course, Peter Venkman. And uh, what we learned is that Dan Aykroyd himself is actually, has done some voice work for the game, as well as uh, William Atherton, who played uh, Walter Peck, who was like the kind of 80s bad guy in that movie. But yeah, so taken directly from the Planet Coaster website, it says, Featuring all new story-driven scenario, uh, novel gameplay mechanics, plus original rides, characters, and scenery straight from the 1984 classic movie. And, you know, I, I think it's interesting that it says it's fully voiced uh, by Dan Aykroyd, so I'm guessing he's not going to be speaking in Planko. I'm guessing it's going to be probably full English, and it says that he's actually going to be kind of guiding you through the custom, the new like kind of story driven scenario. And that's pretty cool. I'm looking forward to that. Um, I'm definitely going to be doing kind of a playthrough of that scenario on the channel because I think that's pretty, pretty awesome and pretty fun. Um, but I wanted to kind of take a look at, so you saw the beginning, the trailer. And if we kind of look back, there's the section where the Ecto-1 comes like roaring in. and. I'm wondering if like this is going to obviously they're gonna have the Ecto-1 in the game but I'm wondering if it's gonna sort of be like the cars that came in the Studios Pack DLC from last year so you have like the cars that kind of like race around uh, you have cars that kind of flip around and you also just have sort of like a stationary car now I don't think that there's gonna be like an Ecto, a version of Ecto-1 that kind of flips around and, you know, kind of looks like it's meant to look like it's exploding like uh, some of the other cars in the Studios pack. But I definitely would be willing to bet that um, just the same way you kind of see these cars going around the tracks here. I, I keep calling it track, but you know what I mean. Um, I'm guessing that there may be at least one version of this, but maybe there'll be a couple different versions. And I'm basing that purely on you know, the way the Ecto-1 comes roaring into the trailer. Besides the fu fully voiced uh, campaign scenario uh, voiced by Dan Aykroyd and William Atherton, there's also two new rides. There's a interactive ghostbusting ride called the Ghostbusters Experience. And from what I read, it, like the guests can actually like, they have to like shoot targets and you know, they kind of try to compete for points. That kind of sounds very similar to like the Men in Black ride in uh, Universal Studios. Um, so I'm kind of wondering if it's going to be a similar ride to that. Uh, they also said that uh, for the first time, uh, us as the player will actually get to participate. Well, you know, you know, you can always do the on ride camera. So it sounds like it's going to be that, but actually interactive and we're going to actually get to shoot. Um, I'm guessing it's going to be you know, a proton pack and you're gonna have to like shoot ghosts and everything and try to 
you know, get up your points. And then there's also going to be a new roller coaster. Uh, it's actually like a kiddie coaster and it's called the Roller Ghoster. Sounds pretty amazing to me. Uh, but yeah, then it also says, you know, there's gonna be classic Ghostbuster characters such as uh, Raymond Stance, Slimer, uh, the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man, and a few surprises. I'm looking forward to seeing that. I would like to see the uh, uh, the Hellhounds. Those would be pretty sweet. Uh, Zool, if we got like a Dana Sigourney Weaver kind of character. But Gozer would be also also uh, pretty awesome. It'd be cool to get Gozer. And you know, there's they're saying it's from the 1984 movie, so I don't know if we'll get like a like a Vigo painting from the second movie, but it says authentic scenery pieces and sounds straight from the 1984 movie, including the Ghostbusters HQ, Spook Central, Ecto-1, and of course the classic uh, Ghostbusters theme from Ray Parker Jr. But yeah, I mean, I just, you know, I thought, man, I'm super excited for this DLC. I can't wait for it to come out. And uh, yeah, when it does come out, expect to see a full kind of overview of the DLC and everything that's included. And then also, like I said, I plan on doing a playthrough on the channel of the new custom scenario. So yeah, let me know in the comments, are you guys excited for this DLC? It's also interesting, uh, this is the most expensive DLC, currently priced at $14.99 uh, American dollars. So, you know, most of them are like $10.99. $10.99, so I'm guessing, you know, being that it's a licensed product, uh, probably has to be a little bit more expensive to cover those costs, but let me know in the comments, are you guys excited about it? Do you guys like the Ghostbusters, um, you know, movie? Do you, you know, what would you like to see in the DLC? I'm sure there's going to be more, uh, released, or, you know, kind of more info released before the, uh, you know, DLC drops on us, but yeah, so... I'm super excited for it. I hope you're excited for it too. Um, I think it's gonna be a whole lot of fun. And yeah, so that's pretty much it for this video. I just, I was so excited. I felt like I needed to do a video on it. So be sure to leave your comments, suggestions, and feedback down below. I am 8 Josh, and thanks for watching. See ya.